dive into movies and TV series where we make vocabulary, idioms, and grammar unforgettable in minutes. Ready to unlock the cinematic secrets of English? Welcome to Crow English. Amanda? What are you doing? Well, I couldn't sleep. And it has been such a hellish year for us, as you know. Hellish means very bad or unpleasant. The hellish heat didn't stop them from getting a jump on their beach trip. And I just seem to be working every day without even realizing it. And you are just constantly anxious about your job because of all the budget cuts. So I went online this morning and I rented us a beautiful house out by the beach. And it was such a steal even though it's barely the off season. Off season is a period of the year when there is less activity in business. We tend to go skiing during the off season because it's cheaper. Wait, are you, are you packing? Yeah, I thought I'd get a jump on it. Get a jump on something is an idiom that means to just start doing something before other people start or before something happens in order to win an advantage for yourself. Psyched about the big game, Jane wanted to get a jump on her training, so she started practicing early in the morning. Wait, I don't understand. When did you rent the house for? Today. I figured if I made the reservation and packed our bags, it would eliminate most of the reasons to say no. Oh, and I printed out the little thingy there for you from the website. Thingy. You refer to something or someone as thingy when you do not know or cannot be bothered to use the proper word or name for them. Can you pass me that thingy? You know, that clip thing for holding papers together. It's right by your coffee. I made it just the way you like it. I didn't want to wake the kids, so I haven't packed for them yet. But honestly, I think they're going to be super psyched about this. Psyched about something means excited or emotional about something. We're so psyched about this party. Well, you know me. I'm not always down for a little vacay. Be down for is an informal expression often used in casual conversation. It generally means being willing, ready, or enthusiastic about doing something. Even though it's the off season, I'm still down for a beach trip. Let's sit with the kids. We haven't done that in a while. But help me out here, babe. I mean, <laughs> why today? Help me out. This is an informal expression, often used to ask for assistance or clarification in a particular context. In this example, help me out suggests the person is seeking understanding or an explanation for why something is happening today. Well, when I couldn't fall back asleep this morning, I came over here to watch the sun rise. And I saw all these people starting their day with such tenacity, such verve. Tenacity is the determination to continue what you're doing. Verve refers to great energy and enthusiasm. It often implies a lively and spirited quality, suggesting a dynamic and energetic style or manner. For example, a person might speak with verve, meaning they speak with passion. 
despite facing difficulties. His tenacity helped him succeed in completing the project on time. Even after a long day, he's always down for a party, dancing with incredible verve. All in an effort to make something of themselves, make something of our world. Amanda? What are you doing? Well, I couldn't sleep. And it has been such a hellish year for us, as you know. And I just seem to be working every day without even realizing it. And you are just constantly anxious about your job because of all the budget cuts. So I went online this morning and I rented us a beautiful house out by the beach. And it was such a steal, even though it's barely the off season. Wait, are you, are you packing? Yeah, I thought I'd get a jump on it. Wait, I don't understand. When did you rent the house for? Today. I figured if I made the reservation and packed our bags, it would eliminate most of the reasons to say no. Oh, and I printed out the little thingy there for you from the website. It's right by your coffee. Made it just the way you like it. I didn't want to wake the kids, so I haven't packed for them yet. But honestly, I think they're going to be super psyched about this. Well, you know me. I don't want to down for a little vacay. Especially with the kids. We haven't done that in a while. But help me out here, babe. I mean, <laughs> why today? Well, when I couldn't fall back asleep this morning, I came over here to watch the sunrise. And I saw all these people starting their day with such tenacity, such verve, all in an effort to make something of themselves. Make something of our world. <laughs>